Hello and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, we are going to do the SAP installation in Windows 11 machine. So this video will help you on install and set up SAP in very simple and easy steps. Before start, please support us by subscribing this channel and click on the like button. This really helps us and motivate us on creating more informative content. Let's start. In order to install SAP, we need uh, SAP setup file and the server details. So we are going to see the step by step and we'll do the everything so that will help you on do, doing same thing in your machine. So let me go to the folder. So you can see here, like I have this SAP GY8.00 version. So in this tutorial, we are going to install this SAP 8.0 and uh, you can download this SAP setup file uh, uh, from the uh, uh, Google Drive and the link is available in the description section. So you can also get this SAP setup file from the SAP site itself. But in order to get from the SAP, you have to register uh, using your email and then only you'll be able to get it. So uh, getting from SAP site is little uh, complex. So if you want, you can get it directly from the Google Drive and link is available in the description section. So once you have the file, so what you have to do, you have to do a uh, double click and it will do the extraction and it will take a couple of minutes and it will do the installations. So once the screen will prompt, so you have to click on the yes button and now the SAP window will open. Click on the next button and here you have to select this SAP GY 8.00 again next. So the installation is done. Now we can see this. Let's close this. Now you can see this SAP logon is available here. And also if you want, you can open it from the start menu. So you have to just click here and it will open the SAP GUI logon pad. So here, what you have to do, once you log in for the first time, you have to click on this symbol, okay, which is basically a place where you have to add the server details. Once you click here, you have to put the server details. So click on the next button and here you can see you have to select this custom application server. So here you have to put the descriptions. Let's add the description. And the application server. Then click on the next button and these details will provided by uh, your uh, SAP service provider. In case if you want uh, to use these details to access SAP, so that also we can provide you. So you have to click on the next button, then click on the finish. So now we can see the SAP is uh, uh, the server details got registered successfully. Now you have to click on the server details. And it will open this page here you have to pass your username and the password so once you click on the login button it will open so let's see if you want to open any of the screen so it will open it so by this way we can do the sap installation this is very simple and easy uh, steps to do the installation so in case if you're looking for uh, SAP server details for practice or training purpose, you can contact us. So we'll help you on providing uh, the SAP server details. 
can download the setup file from the link which is present in the description or if you have any question please uh, you can email us or you can post in the comment section thank you for watching this video